Hi Aquarius, I'm Eddie Rose with PsychicFuture.com and this is your horoscope from the 22nd to the 28th of October. So this is quite a big week that we've got ahead of us because we've got a lot happening in the skies. So the first one is the sun is moving into Scorpio, so we're starting Scorpio season. And that is going to be conjunct Venus, which is still in retrograde. Now on the other side of things, we've got a full moon on the same day, which is in Taurus, and then Uranus, your ruling planet, is going to be conjunct this full moon. So you're probably going to feel this quite strongly, perhaps more than some of the other signs, because your ruling planet is involved. So in particular, this full moon might bring up some emotions that you're a little bit confused about. And they might be very kind of changing because Uranus is all about change and growth and kind of like slightly erratic energy. So you might find that, you know, midweek or perhaps leading up to or after the full moon, just any time this week, that you are having kind of like emotional reactions to things that you're not really sure where they've come from. So it's really important this week to try and take a look at those emotions and actually try and figure out where they are coming from. So if you feel like you get upset with something or with somebody, think about why you are upset, like at a deeper level, you know, is it because you feel like you've had your feelings, or your pride hurt, is it because, you know, you are tired, is it like, where is this upset coming from? And then, you know, if you feel things like anger, like maybe, maybe try and let it out rather than repressing it, try and, you know, go for a run or do some dancing or jump up and down or like just you know, scream into a pillow, do something that is like letting these emotions come out rather than stuffing them back in and pretending that they're not there because, you know, that is just going to keep them, you know, it stuck in your baggage and then you're going to carry them with you. So, yeah, basically all of this stuff is just a culmination of the Venus retrograde period that we've just had, Libra season, all the stuff that I've been talking about like self-worth, self-love, all of this stuff now is going to be having a, sh a light shined on it by this full moon and it's going to be up to us to figure out what we're going to do with this stuff and whether or not we want to take it into the next kind of towards the new moon period so yeah if you need some time to meditate or to like just take some time to yourself so that you can figure this stuff out and you can think a little bit deeply about yourself and about where any of these emotions come from then try and do that but for the most part just try and be patient with yourself because you know it's it's only going to be this week and then after that things will settle down a little bit but for now it's all kind of being stirred up so that we can grow from it so let's pick you a tarot card for this Let's have a card for Aquarius, this full moon. The Six of Wands, victory. Okay, so yeah, this is talking about feeling relaxed, feeling like you have come to some sort of conclusion over something, feeling like you've wrapped something up and you've kind of, you know, you feel victorious about, you know, having something that has been affecting you negatively has now come to a close because the six of wands comes after the five of wands. Five of wands is like struggle and, you know, strife and all these kind of like uh, conflicting views and conflicting feelings and this kind of thing. Whereas the six is like, you've come over that hump now and you've kind of dealt with it and you can now feel victorious and ready to move forwards. So yeah, this is kind of just essentially saying what I was just saying where just get any of your emotions out, get any of your feelings out, you know, figure out what is going on so that you can wrap it all up and then, you know, pop it somewhere else and then you can move forwards feeling a little bit more refreshed and a little bit more victorious. So yeah, happy full moon guys, have a lovely week and I hope to see you next time. Much love.